Hello guys, this is another tutorial number 4 of the source control inside Unreal Engine with the kit GitLab and for now I will show you how to how, how to work inside the editor uh, in the Unreal Engine. Uh, I will open the project. Yes, for now we can do the little setup here. And we have the project, it's working, it's working and we have a knuckle this and yeah. And this is 4.25 and for now I need to check first git git plugin. Yeah, you should have this plugin enabled here. And after this you can uh, go to your source control window, connect to source control, you need to choose one. And here you should take the git beta version. Okay, we have the git patch, we have the user, email and this whole stuff. And we should ra ra run a sub settings. Yeah, we are connected uh, and we have all done now and it's mean now I can do some changes and from the editor push to the my wrapper but I recommend to do this from the folder and from the git bash this console uh, it's just for me but I like to do from my like hands right right git commands to, to, to push you know uh, from here it's just my way but I like it mostly but you can do the same from the editor I will show you and for now like how we can work uh, I can create just for testing here a new blueprint class actor test git actor and you can see here we have this little symbol and uh, this means uh, I have some changes but server ha ha did not have these changes or maybe if you uh, working with the, your teammates and your teammate creates a new actor new actor 2 and you are inside your editor and you see oh okay he created or not maybe not created he modify uh, one uh, one actor actor 2 and he modified here it and it will be have this symbol inside here because you should take the last version from the git version and after that you will have the stable like without you like if you have without the symbol like this it will be great because you have the latest version of this guy and here you see the symbol plus and it means you have something uh, what the server did not have and you should push this new like update to the server to the repository and to do this you can uh, click here and submit to source control and for now you need to write your message like uh, what we did with the git commit I oh, wait some luck I think uh, git commit minus m and text like test text yeah it's just the same like now I will write uh, editor editor uh, new set up from the unreal engine 4 25 and we can submit our changes from the editor great we have this uh, ah maybe it's because check out yes yes maybe it's my bad 
uh, I select the one and I push him on them. You can add maybe more like test, test new actor three. I don't know. You can add. And for pushing, we should write check out modify files. Then we should submit files. Uh, message or get to from uh, the Unreal Editor message to from the Unreal Editor. Yeah, we're done. We push this our update, our new blueprints, or it can be like uh, assets. We push this to the our repository, and I will show you in the repo. We have it here. Um, I'm going. I am clicking here, going to the repo, this one, and for here we can check our folder, and we can go to the content if it's uh, where first person. Okay. Yes. No, no, it's my bad. Source person BP. Ah, like nothing. Okay, we will check the comments because I don't like to push from the Unreal. Yeah, we did not have uh, our two commits. I think we should uh, wait some time, uh, and they will be here also. Uh, and for this, I don't like to do it from the editor. I like better. Uh, I like better to work from the editor and here like git add write git commit my message and git push to origin master and when i will did this it will be immediately be inside my wrapper with this delays you see uh, it will be here but it uh, takes some time and from the unreal editor i don't know why but it sometimes happens for a bit more time but uh, I recommend to use from here, like we did inside updates, and you can uh, you can do whatever you want inside Unreal. But after you can close editor, open your folder, git bash, and push just inside, and it will be work like this. One more thing, and uh, you can work with your other teammates, and if you will open the blueprint. And you do some changes like save yes uh, you will check this blueprint and it means that you uh, check it this blueprint and nobody cannot uh, do changes inside this blueprint he can open it he can like sh check something but he cannot save and push to the server because you locked this guy and to do this to fix you should push your last changes to the repo and then he can pull it like he can take the latest version and he, he can get inside the new version and after he can lock this guy inside you can have the different guys teammates inside the project and everybody can lock what they need and uh, with that you can work with the different things you cannot work together at the one like blueprint you should push the changes inside and he should get them and when he will get uh, it will be like here empty without any symbols and he get, can lock again and to, to do something yeah like this with it's it's because you should not work with the conflicts with the blueprints it's I think a uh, bad part but uh, it works like here also you can add your teammates I will show you in the git I'm going to gitlab uh, like this repository and inside you have the great things like we have a graph like we can see our our changes from the commit at redmi build folder 
and it's on the master branch. You should not have more branches in the drill uh, if you will work like this because you will have only one branch and all you should work inside one this master branch like simple and for more you can add here guys members you can add your teammates inside uh, and you can write what they will do and they can connect to your project also uh, which is the same setup and it will be work like accept, accepted and it's a very great way because you have 20 gigs uh, just free inside and you can work inside Unreal and I think it's a very great way to uh, have a source control inside Unreal and we can try to test stop editor uh, oh it should like we should wait a lot of time I think to maybe 30 minutes or maybe one hour it's not great and I'm better to add like article test uh, and just save close it editor uh, wait, save yes we should save and right here git bash git status we will check ah we we did some but it's saved save it and intermediate but we don't need them and git add point git uh, commit minus m uh, my new my new particle git push origin master and we will push to the server and this from the just here I highly recommend to do this from the folder and from the this git bash to push something uh, editor can take maybe some more time to push it and it's more stable to work with this like this and we can check the our GitLab oh you see we have the a new commit my new particle we can click here we can share ah it's just okay it's the different files and we can check on the tree on our graph new particle oh you see we have now message from the editor the setup editor it's just take more delay time from the editor but it's only on the beta from unreal but it's possible but i i recommend to use just uh, like from the folder and call and push it it will be due immediately and more stable. Thank you guys for watching and if you like the video please like, you can write comments, subscribe to the channel, it will be more uh, great for me and you can motivate me like this to add more content for us and thank you guys for watching and bye.